you guys, welcome back to a windy, windy Eat Local Day here. Uh, we are actually at the Chris Kindle Mart at Wrigley Field in Wrigleyville in Lakeview. The better one, I say. The better it's one. A, it's a tough take. People don't want to believe it. But this is my first say. time at this one. I always go to the downtown one. Uh, we're going to get some raclette, which is like the shaved, the scraped cheese you'll see coming up soon. Two of the raclette sandwiches. We got the brat one. You can do salami, ham, or brat. So we got that. It's got like mustard and pickles on it. And then raclette means to like to scrape. So it's the name of the cheese, the name of the process. It's French. <laughs> At a we German. Nailed it. Yeah, yeah, we nailed it. As a so. matter of fact, do we really need a second angle? We described I don't everything think on so. there. I we'll mean, give you a little more, we'll give you a detailed close-up on there, but I think we named everything on there. We're gonna head back to the office to eat it. One second. Alright, we gave you the like in real time second angle, so we're not gonna do a normal second angle. I mean, just look at all this like look at all this cheese that's kind of clumped up on there already. I mean, come on guys. I've never had this one. And this is your first raclette sandwich. This is. Real quick on the big camera, because we got it. I mean, real quick, you gotta eat these hot, the cheese, you don't want it to coagulate. Uh, yeah, the mustard and the pickles you can get on it. We shared one. I think it was like what 17 bucks maybe Yeah, 17 bucks for this bad boy plus that's without tax, but you know you're out. It's a festival food oh. right, no. We're good. I thought I was hitting the horn. We're good. I didn't, we're not stealing a car. All right the bratwurst raclette sandwich Cheers. Cheers. Damn dude Mmm. Mm. Oh my god. I'm it's just so like it's so perfect for like a Chris Kindle mark. Wow. That tastes so German with that brat. Mmm. Oh my god, love the brat. First glance, what do you like better, the brat or the uh, ham? I don't know which one I like better. Oh, it's wow. honestly tough. Normally I would know an answer like that. I think I like them both the same. Yeah. I love that there's different versions of it. These little mini pickles, I kind of dig that. Oh yeah. Those are interesting. This is a very funky cheese. So I've heard people like not like these sandwiches. Because if you don't like like funky cheese, a very funky it's cheese. a little off-putting. It can be a bit much. Yeah, but I love I love funky cheese. I think the cheese is great. The bratwurst is almost sometimes bratwurst can have too much flavor for me. I'm kind of a I'm not just so soft a little boy. <laughs> Mm -hmm. I can't handle too much flavor. I can't. It takes me down a, 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 a tab or two. Yeah. Is that happening now? That's happening now. Mm. It's very unbelievably flavorful. Like almost to a fault. Uh, overwhelming. If you get one of these, always share it. Like it'd be way too mm -hmm. much to eat a whole one by yourself. I honestly think, I know oh. it's going to seem like a plug, kind of is. I think it kind of needs a sauce. Yeah. I was having one of these recently with Allie and I was like, I love these sandwiches. I think it would do better with a little bit more sauce. See, the mustard on this helps though. The yep. ham ones like don't have that. Oh. It needs a sauce. Otherwise, it's like it's like too strong. It's a great thing for Christmas time, though. Mm. Feels like a cold weather sandwich. Oh my god, yeah. That's meant for it. You're supposed to be eating it out there in the in the weather. Yeah, they wrap it for you because you can walk and eat it. Oh my god, it's crazy, man. There's like so much flavor. Mm, 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 mm. <laughs> I love it without the broth. Like just cheese is great to me. Well, the matter of fact, can I? I was there the other day. Is it possible to? You were fingering that reclat. Yeah, you just shoot it right out. Now it's just, now it's vegetarian. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I went for the traditional. Have now. another rag for your, your the finger. <laughs> oh. <laughs> a guy yesterday oh, got man. two brats on it. He oh, goes, can boy. I get an extra brat? They were like, I don't see why not. <laughs> I'll tell you what, guys, Chris Kindle Market, there's a famous one that's downtown. This one just opened a few years ago in Wrigley. I swear by the Wrigleyville location. It's awesome. And you can go into the stadium for like 10 bucks. They got an ice slide. They've got ice bumper cars. They've got an ice skating rink. They've got a train that goes around the infield for little kids. Mm -hmm. They got a, smor a s'mores station. And they've got a like 400 person. It's like not even a tent. Yeah. It's like a full glass building they put up. It's heated. And they've got a giant bar there. And the downtown one to me, maybe you went yesterday. It was probably not bad. Yeah, it was not. Every time I go, it's so packed on the weekend. That's why I did it. So yesterday, for just context of filming this video, it was a Monday afternoon. Yeah. Um, so there was like nobody there, which I refused to go on a Saturday. On Saturday? You and I have been there to vlog. It's like uncomfortably crowded. You can't do it. It sucks. I don't think I like this place. I think I could make, I can't make that cheese like this, but if I was allowed to pick what was in it, I could make a better one. Oh, dude, totally. There's agree. some things added to it needs. The cheese is great, the bread's great. You could really go to town and get a little creative. You can make something dumb good. 100%. Very fun, though. I do love that cheese, that's really good. That is funky. So funky. All right, let's go ahead and rate that thing, and on Eat Local, we do that with a thumbs up or a thumbs down. It takes into account taste, the ease of getting it, the price, like the whole thing of like, should you get that or not? You got your answer? Yeah, oh yeah. All right, drum roll, please. Thank you, sir. Oh! oh. 
I mean, it's expensive. It is. But dude, you're out on the town. You you want to go enjoy a Christmas in Chicago? Yep. You gotta go there. You gotta get that. It's mm -hmm. so delicious. Spend the money. You're out, you're doing. You're doing touristy stuff. You're gonna yeah. spend some money. Split one with somebody. It's more tolerable. Yeah, dude. All right, guys, make sure you like the video, subscribe to the channel, come join us on our Eat Local journey. And then a quick question for you guys, so we can hang out down in the comment section. How would you make that better? Yeah. I know it could be done. I got thoughts. I kind of want a, a chicken version of that. I think the three, I do now. Their three meat options might have been the, oh. It's so Europe. It was the most Europe meat options. There we go. What are you looking at? I see sometimes people on those little scooters and they're on the street. Yeah, they're gonna get smoked or something? She was just crossing. I looked like she was using the bike lane. And not a stand-up scooter, an old person scooter. Right. Or a big boy The scooter. ride ones. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, sorry, off track. How could you make that better? <laughs> those three meat options were okay at best. Yeah. I think they could be way better with some other options and maybe some other additives on there. Let us know what you got. We'll see you again soon. Yeah. We love you guys so much. And let's keep on cruising. Let's keep on eating. Let's keep on feasting. Guys, we'll see you soon. We love you. Eat local. It's more fun that way.